When you have multiple sclerosis, you lose a little of yourself every day. This is what MS does. It takes things away. It destroys connections within our minds and our bodies and disconnects us from the ones we love. There is only one thing that can stop it. MS Research. I recognized the symptoms back in September of 2002 and it took about four months to figure out what it was. Back then, there was only four medicines you could take. Now there's you know 12 different medicines and I just recently switched to one of the oral medicines. Knowing now that I can take my medicine, I have any side effects, no other issues, for me it's a huge weight off my shoulders. I can just be a dad and coach my kids' baseball teams and play basketball and soccer with them. I mean, I definitely think we're on the right path. I mean, you know, the, the jumps we've made in five years I, I gotta imagine the next 115 will be making this jump after jump and hopefully one of those jumps will be a cure, you know, and one of the three and hopefully not all three cures um, to stop restoring and it, that'd be just fantastic just knowing that my kids never have to worry about getting this disease. For people with MS, the answers can't come fast enough. There is no time to waste. Research is essential to finding solutions that change lives. We must know more and do more not tomorrow or next week, but now. The National MS Society is at the center of MS research worldwide. We are determined to find solutions for everyone with MS, not just a few. It's our highest priority and our promise to people with MS. We pursue all promising paths, identifying the research with the most potential and applying the needed funding and influence to drive progress while staying focused in three priority areas progressive MS, nervous system repair, including myelin repair, and wellness. You, you never know what you're going to get with MS. I was at UC Berkeley um, studying the visual system, getting my doctorate in optometry when I went blind in my left eye. I knew what it was right away. I'm hopeful for uh, actually walking again one day. I think with mental power, heart power, the energy of the heart and the mind, and of course, the research, the physical research and all the physical exercises. Do I believe that I can walk again? Yes, I do. I do. It's a matter of time. We have made progress. We recruited more than 800 new researchers into the MS field. We pioneered the new field of nervous system repair. We paved the way for all existing therapies, none of which existed 20 years ago. But for some people, there are still no solutions at all. We must keep learning. We must keep connecting. There's a few things that I wish that I could do that really strike my heart. And one of them is being able to walk hand in hand with my wife. I mean, Gosh, we used to love to take long walks, and to have to give that up um, was, that one took a while to reach acceptance. I think in my case especially, we need to find a mechanism to regrow that myelin such that I can reconnect my nervous system so that my legs will work again, because I believe that I will walk again. This is a pivotal moment, the time to accelerate our progress, to establish connections that drive new scientific discoveries and new treatments, to expand investments that create solutions to change the world for people with MS. There is not a moment or a dollar to waste. Join us in taking MS head on. Together, we can change lives. Together, we can create a world free of MS.